YouTube. Full disclosure, this is a sponsored video. I was given money in order to play this game. I'm going to give half of the money that I get to the editor that made this video. But I was not required in any way to say any sort of positive things or whatever, whatever about the game. I was allowed to give my own genuine opinion as I was playing it. I had my gripes, but I had a lot of positives because they genuinely did make a good game. Thank you very much to Dino Rocket and Fireshine Games for sponsoring me and for uh, uh, reaching out and, and thinking that I was a really good creator. Honestly, they headhunted me like crazy. They really, really wanted me to play this game, and I completely understand why. I hope you enjoy the content. Let me know your genuine and honest feedback in the comments. And uh, yeah, I, I, again, thank you again for the for the sponsorship. Okay, okay, enjoy, enjoy, enjoy content that was paid for. Mwah. You can check out Katamon right now in the link in the description or in the top comment. It is 10% off for the limited future, so get it while you can. Welcome to the world of Katamon. I'm Professor Nock, but people just call me Professor. As a researcher, I'll be here to guide you throughout your adventures. This world is filled with mysterious creatures called Katomon. Katomon are all around us, having fun adventures of their own. They like to travel with those who prove themselves strong. So if you want to meet every Katomon, you'll have to be ready to fight. Help with my research, I've collected three rare Katomon. Bayleaf is a grass-type Katomon. It's not super strong on its own, but it's really good at supporting its allies at the start of battle. Monku is a fire-type Katamon. Monku is an aggressive battler, able to, to quickly counter an opponent's attack. Kreeze is a water-type. This Katamon is strong defensively, able to protect both allies and itself. You can choose one to travel and battle alongside you. You can track what types of Katamon you have in your team currently using this helpful meter. If you have two or more Katamon of the same type, you'll unlock a special abilities called Synergies. Really good animations. I like the way that it, like, zooms in on the helpful things. I might take a Monku. This guy's got crazy health. Right, let's go, Monku. If you're in your adventures, you'll travel all around the world across areas we call regions. No two regions are alike, and each of them is filled with new Katamon to discover. At the start of the adventure, you'll see a list of available Katamon in that region on the left. It might look empty at first, but you'll encounter new Katamon the more this list will fill out. There's like 230 in the game, by the way. By hovering over a new area, you can see what types of Katamon you will encounter. To begin your adventures, left click on the area on the bottom of the map. You can go lightning, ice, toxic, or toxic bug. What do you think my fire type would be good against? Probably ice and earth. Congratulations, you've started your first battle. In battles, you'll come up against teams of wild Katamon. Do I have a gnome on my team? Oh, it's Nock. <laughs> Win, and you'll get rewards and the opportunity to have a wild Katamon to join you on your adventures. Lose, and your team will lose morale. When your team's morale hits zero, your adventure will end. To help out, I've lent some of my assistants. Nock. Nock are not powerful fighters, but they are very helpful in a pinch. In battle, the, in, uh, the order of your team is very important. Some Katamons are better suited to be at the front of the queue so that they can protect their allies. Others might have abilities that requires them to be further back so that they can support from the rear. To rearrange the order of your queue, you can pick up and drag in your units using left click. Regular Katamon uh, to open their card to expand a view it. Try it now. Every Katamon is different with unique stats and abilities to help you in battle. At the top of the card, you'll find their score stats, health, attack, and speed. On top right, you'll find their typing. Katamon can have up to three types at the same time. Katamons will also deal bonus damage against opponents if their type is strong against the opponents. To check what types are strong against others, here's a helpful chart. Oh, every Katamon has a unique passive ability. These abilities can trigger in many ways to help turn the tides of battle. Make sure you read the description to check out how to activate their Katamon's passive ability. Some Katamon also have keyword augments, which grant them additional abilities. Not every Katamon has these, though, so keep an eye out. The attack is in yellow, the Katamon's super attack. Wait, oh. These powerful attacks will trigger once a Katamon is built up enough energy, enough charge during a battle. Don't worry about those for now. We'll sure show you them in action shortly. To get back to the action, press the close button. To start the battle, hold down the play button. Battle has begun, I'm rooting for you. At the bottom, you see be able to check the, the, the battle's status. The top bar is the Katamon's health. Once they hit zero, they will faint and exit the battle. The bar at the bottom is the speed bar. This will fill automatically. Oh, yeah. When it's full, the Katamon will perform a normal attack, dealing damage based on its attack stats. Most Katamon will attack the front most Katamon on their opponent's queue, but there are some special abilities allowing them to hit the first, uh, uh, the first back. 
middle bar is your charge, which will be filled bit by bit when your Katamon performs its normal attacks. Once it is full, Katamon will reach their po powerful super attack. You control the speed of the battle at the top. Good luck. Congratulations, you won! After battle, your Katamon will gain experience points. Once they accumulate enough points, something exciting will happen. Okay. We know what it sounds like is gonna happen, Chad, but they're gonna evolve, okay? They're not, they're gonna evolve. Here you can see the breakdown of how well each Katamon performed in battle. You'll see how much damage they did, how much health they lost, and how much they recovered or shielded. After battle, you get gain rewards. You'll gain two gold, it will always gain two gold berries. These can be exchanged to the shop for new Katamon experience points. You also get to add a wild Katamon to your team. There's endless combinations, so be sure to try out all the new allies all the time. Winning will cause the two counters at the top to count down by one. Okay. When those hit zeros, you'll gain bonus rewards. When the left counter hits zero, you'll get a bonus item. Items can be equipped to Katamon to grant them bonuses in battles. Claim your rewards by left clicking on them one by one. After battle, spawn a bull baby or grant one 10 XP. It was a bull baby. Bone armor. Ally fainted, gain 100% of attack or shield. On attack, deal three damage to a random enemy. Maybe I take fire slime since I've got the fire guy. Select a field effect. Ally ahead hurt, gain two strength. After super, grant ally plus two max HP. Ooh. Wait, that's probably really good to get early, right? To like start building some max H. Right, let's take this. Once you selected which field effect you want, that icon will effect will appear. You can change your effects at any time I have over the icon. So I want to put this on you. Wait, this guy gains a fucking bomb. So this is the shop. I think we're in the shop right now. Okay, where was that item that I got? Oh no, it just sits there. Oh, okay. So it's just, it just exists. Okay, so it's just a relic. Oh, let's move on then. These are the basics. Hope that help. I'll chime in from time to time. But good luck with your adventures. All right, sweet. Mini boss. Okay. Look at my little guy, man. All right, let's go next. Oh, we can rearrange here. Okay, let's put our bull baby in front. Because we don't fucking care if they die. Let's put it on slow for now. Let's put you in front because we don't care if you die. Wait, 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 wait. Why is it throwing decay on you? What does decay do? It's poisoning him. Frostbell. Any revived deal two damage to the lowest enemy. Hurt deal one poison damage and gain in one. Attacks require one bonus. Remove a stack on. Oh, okay. So you're basically just you're 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 basically just giving them poison. And decay makes them take damage whenever they attack you. So it's like thorns. So I think I'm gonna take a plurple. Holy wait! So these guys are going fucking crazy with giving XP to our guys. Okay, so we definitely don't need knock. So sorry, but I don't think I want to knock. Um, we could put a talk. Wait, let's get a toxic slime. Wait, and then put it on the guy that already gives slime to so double decay. Wait, this is huge. Wait, this is massive. Okay. Once in chat, if we should take the mini boss. 
You found your first mini boss area. Careful now. These Katamon are far more powerful than your average wild encounter. Defeating them will be special rewards. You'll give it your best. Okay, I think I'm still gonna put Bull Baby in front. Mm, you're pretty tanky though. What do these guys do? Deal four damage to the back enemy. Okay, let's pull Bull Baby in the back. No, no, no. Let's put. Let's put. No, no, no. Let's do this. And then let's pull Bulbish in the back. You in the front. Bull Baby in seconds because you're gonna deal. You're gonna go into the act. Enemy move. The lowest enemy has moved to the back. Okay, that's gonna be Bull Baby. That's fine. Okay, let's go. No, we're gonna fuck these guys up. They're getting giga slowed right now. Which means they're just never gonna attack in a second. Wait, look, they're just never fucking attacking. Wait, they're actually not attacking. Wait, are they dead permanently? <laughs> Turn all grass types into fire types. Instantly gain 40 morale when it reaches Zuri Adventure is over. Oh, so that's like the team health. Front ally takes two less damage. Rock solid. Wait, we should turn all grass types into fire because we already have a fire type, so it would create synergies. Oh, we couldn't see the mini boss with a fa face cam. I'm so sorry. All right, I'm gonna set fire to the bush. Select an item. Wait, small... Wait, 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 small stick. Wait, 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 small stick. Because this guy, when he gets hurt, he gains he gains one damage. Wait, that's actually big. He already is holding an item. No, 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 you're not listening. On attack, deal damage to ally behind. So I put it on the guy in front of him. So then it deals damage to him. Gain one shop tickets and two dollars. Yeah, so we put it on we put it on bull baby. So now he goes bing bang boom bang 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 bang. And then shop ticket used to restock the shop. Gain one stock. Okay, okay. So this allows us to just get a free restock. That's cool. On equip, granted ally plus two consume. Oh, so I just gave him plus two attack. That's sick. Release the gnome. Yeah, he has eaten the XP. And then on equip, gain plus five XP and consume. Oh, that's sick. Okay, we're going into an earth ice fight. Yeah, I think it might be best for me to go like bot right. Okay. Um, I obviously want Monku to be in the backpack if possible. And then you get moved up. They're playing slow to the fastest enemies. Okay, so order here. We're going to do you up front. Bull baby goes there. And then you go here, so you're hitting him. Okay, let's go. Damn it, you're not seeing everybody all the time. Okay, we go up here. We go right here. That's fine. Dude, Monku's actually getting so fucking strong in the back. He's got 15 AD right now. I'll be honest, I have no idea what is going on most of the time on the screen, but my brain loves it. One in the chat if you agree. Yo, up, Alchemy! I imagine that we'll figure out what is what is going to happen in the future, but for now, I have no idea. Ally hurts, gain... Wait... Lower is faster. So then why would I want to gain slow? Convert all my slow into strength. Ooh. Look, Mom, I'm on TV. Read, Tristan. Hurt, summon a level one snowball. Yeah, no, we're taking this because we're hurting our allies all the time. Okay, so now... I think we can get rid of Bull Baby. I do like the XP that he's giving, though. Wait, Chad, did we get rid of Bull Baby or Bullbish? 
fuck a bull bishop. Okay, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Need to keep the guy with this stick? Well, I'm assuming that I can probably take this stick back. Bull baby's almost leveled up. Here's a here's a good question that I don't want answered by people in chat because I know there are people in chat that know answers. Because I don't want spoilerinos. It says after battle, but did they have to participate in the battle? I'm assuming yes, but only one way to find out indeed. They also have a grub buddy. All right, let's go. Uh-oh. He's slowing down in order to unleash his mega attack soon. Holy man. Um, I think we probably just take a skip here. It didn't proc. Okay, so this, this guy doesn't do shits. Okay, we know now. Do we try to combine two sticks? What was the bonus XP? You had a dupe. Oh, wait. Oh, if you select a dupe, it gives you bonus XP? Let's see what happens if we try to combine. Let me move my camera real quick. We're gonna try to combine. It didn't work. We could upgrade you, level you up real quick. Damn, so close. Um. You only have 13 health. What if we, like, doubled up on the small stick? Edit and upgrade your team or a mini boss. Hmm. Let's try the campsite. Let's just see what it does. You found your first rest area. Come take a breather. At rest areas, you can make adjustments to your party when needed. You can also choose one of the above rewards to take with you on your journey. You can grant one cut amount of bonus experience points, or unit gains this type if possible. Oh. Yes, we want a grass because that makes them fire. Right? We want grass because grass becomes fire. Right? This guy's fire. This guy's fire. This guy's fire. This guy's fire. So we need to make plurple fire. Oh, I have to... Oh, it's not possible for them to... Oh, they can't, they can't, they can't, they can't. I just didn't drag right. I had to figure out what to do. But that was so sick. Okay, now do we go take the mini boss? Deal six damage to the back enemy. What is the fire synergy giving? Do I, where do I see that? Fire grants all allies. Ooh, look at that shit. Two, four, or eight. Eight damage to all allies. These guys all just move enemies to the back. Yeah, I think we move Plurple to the back. I think we move you up to the front. And we still do this chain gang of hitting. I think this should work. Ball Baby's the one that's going to move to the back because they're the lowest. Oh, what is Fox? Good monkey! buddy Manku, get in there what are you doing Manku, you're doing fucking nothing buddy ah! wait bull baby's evolving into a ball baby <laughs> is it just ball baby too oh yeah it gets just, it just gives me increased shits i think we can release you i think you're gone 
And then when we release you, we can then give you some more XP, because you're fucking weak as shit right now, and you're annoying the fuck out of me. Let's go ahead and reorder you again. After ally super grant the front ally some thorns. Okay. Right, let's keep going. Feels like your team needs some speed. Yeah, probably. We're really strong in normal fights. If we just keep finding that one elite, we're just going to keep getting fucked up. Dude, when Manku like, hits, he just fucks him up. He just needs some fucking speed. Nice. So this fucker just evolved into poop. Poople. Poop. No. This guy evolved into propulsion. Um... Buy two sticks and see if they can combine into something cooler. Come across an event where you can choose your action. Random events. Yeah, I know what random events are. Yeah, no, I, I know what random events are. I'm not going to read carefully. Flash your advertisement on the main footpath. Point towards you a sh towards a Shanka shop. They appear to have a flash sale with items selling two selling for much cheaper than usual. They must have been quite busy, but they must have been quite busy as the shopkeeper appears to have visibly worn out, falling asleep mid sentence. As he attempts to serve you, gain two random items but lose three dollars. Or steal, gain five XP after a mini boss. Dunk is asleep, and you decide to try to take some of the bears. You manage to grab a few without after waking them up. After slowly walking away, one of your party trips over something that wakes, which wakes up Zashanka, who then calls out for help. No! Splash applied. Oh fuck! Oh fuck! What is wetness? Oh, no. The law hits hard. <laughs> Wait, I'm fucking these guys up. They're not taking that much... I'm not... Regen triggered? This guy regen sometimes, right? Regen, he gains armor. What do you- wait. Do you think that it combines- wait. Wait, do you think it combines with this guy? Wait, hold on. I don't think Bull Baby is very good. Yeah, I think we need to replace Bull Baby. I'm with you on that. Take another attack potion. Having poison reduces attack by three. You poison that fucker then. Monku's about to come out with a big hit. Watch this. Get him, Monku! Wait, Manku's actually fucking everybody up. How are we so good at at, at, at early fights and just not jetpack on attack, gain two strength, and take five damage? Wait, is that good? Yeah, we can take some max HP for Manku, that's true. Wait, does this synergize with this guy? Because the other guy puts on poison and then you get a snake and then it snakes them. I think that works fantastic. Yeah, we just do this. Release you. Manku's evolving. He's a 
the chip ear. He's so cute. Okay. Um, we put this on you. We get berries, multi berry. Means plus three, plus armor, and consume. Give that to you. Oh, it has to be. So you have to do it for a combat because it has to be on combat starts. And then we can give this shell berry to you as well, and then it consumes it. Can I combine sticks now? Wait, yeah, let's try. Trigger allies behind the attack? Hey, that's so sick. So it just triggers it without having to deal damage to them. It was plural too. It's true, it is plural. But we don't have... I guess unless we put this guy back, we go like this, and we put Snake in the front? Yeah, we can do that. Do we want to give a billion XP to? Flurple? Oh, he's into Smuggler. Hurt? Collect four wood? Wait, I'm fighting Fortnite. Wait, I'm just gonna fuck them up, though. Wait, they actually just lose. There's no way that I lose this. Wait, I deal so much fucking damage. There's actually zero chance of loss. Wait, my team is so good now. It's literally just Jover. Trigger ally in front super? It looks like the plural wasn't true. It only triggered on one ally. Good to know. Whenever I've seen a chance to not consume items. Front ally takes two damage less. Turns all... No, let's take, let's take rock salad. I'm down with that. Yeah, it doesn't look like all items consume. Okay, we'll do that. You're now our frontliner, that's fine. Let's put this on you to... Oh. No. Does that take battle starts? Hmm. Yeah, it's not plural, it's just this. Hmm. Which means that we would... Need to really think our, of our order right now. So I think you go up front again. You go up front. You don't fucking matter. You're gonna take, you're gonna go like this. You're gonna go bang. You're gonna go bang. You're gonna go like this. We're gonna swap you. This, you're just gonna come in right at the start. You go. Right? Weird berry. What about a weird berry and a multi berry combined? Mm -hmm. All right. Um, I want to go this path. Let's take on. damage was like kind of mid, but wait, 
Wait, I think this is working. I think this is the strongest my team has ever been. I, I, I actually think that this is the strongest my team has ever been by, like, miles. And then we can take the bonus XP. Fuck yes, dude. No, this is huge, man. I just buy all the attack potions for sure. Is that a banana? Maybe we can combine two sticks, make another ladder, and then combine two ladders. Wait, you actually might be a fucking genius. One of the chat of that chatter might be a genius. Healing. This is a banana. Ally ahead hurt. Grant them one max HP and I take two damage. Allies. Trigger ally ahead. Wait. Trigger one allies ahead. Damage one. Wait, this is insane. Wait, is this not really good for us? Is this better than Snakey Snake? I think this is better. This might be better. Than, I want to try it. I want to I try it. this better than Snake. We just need to grab this off of you. It's it, like triggering the guy's attack ahead isn't going to be that good, but I wonder if it only cares about the ally directly in front of them being hurt or if it's all ally. No, it says ally ahead, so it's not allies ahead because this guy is the guy that gets hurt all the time and it's just going to super buff this guy. No, this is good. Trust, 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 trust. Chad, do you trust me? hear a loud noise coming from somewhere nearby. You follow the noise for a short while until you come across a clearing of snore, but playing with each other. Grant 30 max HP or select a unit to gain ice. I'll take this. Um, I want you to gain it. Wait, are you a duck now? This is the greatest game of all time. This is the greatest game of all time. I'm gonna say it. I just wanna keep giving my, my characters XP. No, we need to give somebody toxic so that we can upgrade our toxic trait more. Yeah, let's give you toxic so that we can upgrade our toxic trait more. Um, and now we apply four things to, yeah, that's pretty good. No, that was actually shit. That was actually so shit. Why did they do that? They have a Banuck? That's bad. It's the greatest enemy, uh, it's the greatest unit of all time. Wait, it moved my guys around. Oh, no. Wait, it is hitting all allies ahead. Or wait, is this considered ahead? Level two peeler triggers attack of two allies, not just one. Snows is evolving. Wait, Snows? What is he gonna do? Oh, he's got a flower now. Okay, now we want to do this. And then we need to start trading some items. We want to go like this, go like this. Wait, do we actually want to give them a normal stick? Wait, so this is going to trigger this guy's super, which is then going to make you attack twice at the start of enemy at the start of combat, which is then wait. Ah, it's a brain blast moment. I am I'm having a brain blast moment.
Yo, I'll take 30 more XP. Mm. Wait, watch this. Just fucking insta-killed them. And then I killed him again. Wait, you can keep spawning shit. I'm just gonna keep fucking killing it. You're fucking dead. I'm unkillable, motherfucker! I'll take a health potion. I don't need any of these. Get some XP. I really want to see what you do when you level up. Take some health as well. We're almost to the point we can put Chimp here in front, man. I'm power leveling this guy. Um, give me a mini boss. I don't care. Wait, I'm just gonna one shot you. Like, actually, I, I don't think it fucking matters that you're gonna get your super off soon. Like, you're actually just. Oh, you summoned a guy? And then we just fucking insta killed them! Wait, you're fucking. You're fucking dead, dude! You're a mini boss? <laughs> oh, such a bozo. Ally gain shield. Grant one. All summons gain the item of the summoner. <laughs> Lucky coin. No. Ah, skip. Honestly, see you, bud. Dude, he's so close. I love when numbers go up, man. Holy shit. Yeah, that doesn't do anything. Oh. I'm about to fight a whole ass whale. Dude, I, I just one shot people at the start of combat. It's like not even fucking fair. You see the damage that I'm dealing? How is this okay? Here he goes! Here he goes! How can he get any cuter? Holy... I don't need any of these. You're max leveled? Nice. Numbies. I like that it tells you a Pokemon you can find so that you can know if you're gonna get like a level up or not. But it says I max level, but it says I can gain more XP. I wanna know what that does, but I also wanna get my other guys leveled up. Hoop evolves into. Dembature. <laughs> Is 
Is the ability level 3 better? Yeah, his uh, super does AoE to 100% of his damage to all. Instead of 75%. Chat, this is a boss. This is supposed to be a boss. When does he start doing boss things? Guys, the battle's over. Guys, the battle's over. You don't need to keep giving yourself things. It's like the guy when... He's like flexing in Magic the Gathering and just... Continues to do shit. It's like, bro, I don't know what you want, man. We have another one of these, right? We could, we could, we could see if what happens when we combine two of them. Uh, okay. See what happens when we can combine two good berries. Slightly disappointing. All right, we're in the Akomo region. Uh, another banana. That's sick. I don't like that I can't hover over and see what their abilities are in like during the match. I would like that to be a thing. I, you know what? Can I give a hot take real quick? Jack, can I give a hot take real quick? I think that we don't need Smoggy anymore. And I think that we could actually rock Obsidian in front with Banuck behind them to just like buff the fuck out of them. dare you? I'm sorry. This is the way I feel. I'm not getting rid of him anytime soon. I'm just saying, like, I think that we're not realizing our true potential yet. We just need something else to buff. Here he goes, here he goes. How could the duck get any cuter? <laughs> oh my god. This is the greatest game of all time. Ooh. Wait. This could be really good, right? Should we say Bingus Bongus? Put you in front with that on you. Maybe even do like this. Maybe do. Maybe do like a good berry on them. Oh, you can go all the way in the back, huh? So you go in the back, 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 back. Do we need a better item for this? We take that. Because it gives you armor and shit. I'm going towards the mini boss. No instant super on him now? That's true. I don't think it matters. Because this guy is still going to hit the super on him. Right?
Dude, you got 33 damage. Oh, fuck me. Frostbell. Frios, love you, buddy. This guy's scary looking, but I assume we'll just die instantly. He's just moving me around, but he's not doing anything. They're shocking themselves. I assume that was supposed to be cooler. I had... Yeah, if you get moved, you get armor. That's good. Ooh, wait. Loudener is really good. Wait, wait, wait. Loudener for, for banana. Get the loudener for the banana. Or for the, yeah. For the swanana. That's good. Dude, my team is godlike. Boom! Huge man. I'll take the bonus XP, even though it doesn't seem to do anything. They're just still at the max level. Now it makes me want to think that it can do something. Either way, I want to get you to level, get you to level up into big boy. It seems the biggest of rigs. Holy man, Lumbrador! Nice. I want to see more fights. Keep flexing. This is PVE. This is a roguelike. Given a bunch of bonus XP. I don't think this does anything, but. On your path through the jungle, you encounter a giant ravine. After following it for a while, you find a rickety old bridge spanning the gorge below. You're unsure whether or not you should cross here or look for a safer path ahead. Avoid, lose 10 morale, or cross in a Katamon gains. Uh, we can suffer the morale right now. Unfortunate, but it is what it is. We have no water type. You're now a water type. Come on, get him, Obsidian. Obsidian? Ob 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 a simi. Big punchy boy. Is that a banana goose? It's a swanana. Swanana. Skip me, kiss me. So I still don't know how to get hyper evolutions, but that is a thing. That apparently if you give certain items to certain allies, they get a hyper evolution. Which I would love to know. If anybody that's played this game knows that I have the availability of one, I give you permission to shout it out, but don't spoil what I need to do. But be like, yo, you can give this, you know, like you have a thing that upgrades this guy or something. You don't have it yet? I didn't think so. I figured they were very rare. 
you think you can keep summoning things? If there was ever a thing to give to my flame guy. You sold it though, you had it? What do I need? What do I need what do I need so I can look for it? Anti-gravity belt. Flame belt is crazy, but it's probably not crazy right now. It's on your screen, think carefully. Anti-gravity ball? Flies one slow to the fastest enemy. So it's either flame belt on my monkey guy or slow on my flying guy. Wait, am I on the right track, Wilroyd? Yes, you are, but think carefully. Okay, anti-gravity ball because this guy's name was Propulsion. Is that correct? No, it isn't. So it's flame belt on this guy? No, it's flame belt on Luchador. It's flame belt on Luchador because he's a fucking the fighter guy. I wish it was like that. Frost, just ask. No, I'm not gonna do that. Okay, so it's not on you. So you have to like leave it on for a combat? They need to gain XP while holding the item. So I don't think it was that one. <laughs> so it's on this guy. So after this battle, he'll gain it. Buy a mon, sell it for candy. Hyper Optimon. Holy! I don't like that it didn't have an animation. I would have liked to see a cute little animation, but. Fight a mini boss from this region. Sorry, I should have read what it did. Oops, it was a ship, though. He's so big! Now he evolves. Wait, is he gonna... Now this is unprecedented. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Turn all dusk types into physical. Oh. Let's take this. This is the final boss since my guys are all upgraded. Enemy faint, summon a random portal. Oh, hey, it's a portal. We didn't get to see what the portal did because we fucking killed it. Hey, it's a random portal. We didn't get to see what the random portal did because we fucking killed it. Oh, does the portal summon dudes from my from my box? Summon all Katamon released at level two. Oh. Round fucking two, baby. Wait, I have to kill my bull Oh. Wait, dude, I'm, I'm getting fucked up. Wait, this guy has 900 fucking giga da damage. But he has, to he has to attack Luchador right now. He has to attack Luchador, and he's not dealing that much damage. 
Okay. Now who's he gonna attack? Probably Obsidimon. Yeah. Oh, sevens. Oh, fucking sevens, man. That was the tutorial, guys. <laughs> yeah, that guy seemed fucking insane. Holy, man.